If you're a subscriber of my channel, you should know that my past few reviews have been of various USB charging stations. Today I'm going to put each one to the test and find out which is the perfect USB charging station for you. Hey guys, Sam here from Speedline Technology. Today I'm going to be comparing three USB charging stations, which are from Inatech, RAV Power, and Koitech. So first of all, let's take a look at the packaging. Straight away, it's clear that the Inatech box is larger, both in height and width. That then the Koitech box is a tad bit smaller, and then finally the RAV Power box is smaller in height. The Inatech packaging is highly detailed and looks great. The Koitech box does not contain any information about the product, however, it simply has their logo and that's it. And finally, the RAV Power box is well designed too, with lots of information and a diagram of the device on the rear. Opening each one up, we see the complete opposite in the size of the devices compared to the boxes, but we'll get to that in a second. Unpacking the Inatech box, we have the device itself, the mains power supply, and a user manual. Straight away you'll notice that the power supply comes with a massive transformer. This is because the manufacturer could not fit the transformer inside of the actual charging station because of its size. But this does also happen to increase the cable length. Moving on to the Koitec box, we have the device itself, a mains power supply, and a user manual. This time, however, we don't have a transformer, unlike the Inatech charging station. Finally, taking a look inside the RAV power box, we have the device itself, a user manual, and then the power supply. And again, this time it doesn't have a transformer. As I said previously, the size of the devices is the complete opposite to the size of the boxes. The Inatech charging station is clearly the smallest at 57mm in height and 102mm in width. It also has a thickness of 21mm. It has 5 ports, 3 universal and 2 supercharge. Putting it on the scales, it weighs around 73 grams. The Koitec has six ports with a special IC that can detect how much power the connected device requires. Uh, also, it weighs 155 grams and it is 71.5 millimeters in height and 88.4 millimeters in width. Finally, it has a thickness of 25 millimeters. Finally, the RAV power charging station is 88.9 millimeters in height and 91.44 millimeters in width, with a 30.48 millimeter thickness. It has four ports in total, two, new, two universal and two supercharged. Also, it weighs 180 grams. The only device to have a power button is the Inatech, and it also has an LED light along with the RAV power. Also, another positive for the Inatech is that it has a very long cable length at 2.6 meters when compared to Koitech's 1.5 meters and RAV Power's 1.2 meters. Taking a look at the prices, the RAV Power comes in the cheapest at $12.99, followed by the Inatech at $13.99, then the dearest of the three is the Koitech at $14.99. The durability of all three devices is great. They don't feel as if they're going to break easily as they're all made from sturdy plastic. However, the stability isn't great at all on the Inatech and it does slide around on a flat surface, but the Koitech and RAV Power both have rubber elements keeping them down on flat surfaces. So now that we have talked a little bit about each one, let's find out which one is the best. So I put together a little spreadsheet, which is actually linked down in the description below. This spreadsheet allowed me to calculate which is the best USB charging station out of the three. Now remember, this is all of my opinion, and I gave the size, design, durability, control, stability, and price a score out of five to work out the overall score out of five. So here's the results. Coming in at third place with the bronze medal, we have the RAV Power 4 port wall charger. I gave this a 3 in size, a 3 in design, a 5 in durability, a 1 in control, a 5 in stability, and a 4 in price, which equaled a 3.5 overall. The LED is way too bright to have switched on in a bedroom at night, but the design is okay, and the device um, has great stability, keeping it down on a flat surface at all times. Also, the device is always reliable and always charges multiple devices simultaneously. The only flaw is the short power cable. 
Next up with the silver medal in second place, we have the Koitech Smart 50 watt USB power adapter. I rated this a 4 in size, a 5 in design, a 5 in durability, a 1 in control, a 3 in stability and a 4 in price, which gave me an overall of 3.6. The design is perfect with a two-tone style, however the device doesn't have an LED light or a power button. The cable length is great at 1.5 meters, not too short and not too long. Finally, this device is the dearest out of the trio, but it's really worth the money. And finally, in first place with the gold medal, we have the Inatech 5 port 35 watt USB family size desktop charger with a 5 in size, a 4 in design, a 4 in durability, a 5 in control, a 0 in stability and a 5 in price equal in a 3.8 overall. The design is great, the LED isn't too bright and it has a power button. And the device is always reliable, just like the RAV power. Finally, the cable is the longest out of the three products, however the only flaw is the massive transformer and the lack of stability. But if there wasn't a transformer, the product itself would be a lot bigger and the cable length would most likely be a lot shorter. Like I said before, this is my opinion, and you may have a completely different verdict on these products, but if you do, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Also, just remember, these ratings aren't bad. They were all very, very close at 3.5, 3.6, and 3.8. They're All three of these products are really great ones, and they were really difficult to compare with each other. I hope that the manufacturers of the products can watch this video and get ideas and inspiration for future products. The link to the spreadsheet will be in the description below for your viewing, along with the links for my review of each product and the purchase page for each product. My name is Sam and you have been watching Speedline Tech TV. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.